Hello, hello, my wonderful audience. Your boy Balls on you here, and I am bringing you Five Nights at Freddy's Sister Location. Now, this was released today. You guys are probably not going to see this until Sunday. I'm sorry about the delay, but I did get into this the first day it came out, and I want to check it out. Now, I have not looked up on any of anything about this game. I don't know the premise. I don't know the background. I don't even know how to play. So, without further ado, we're going to hop in, and we're going to bring you Five Nights at Freddy's Sister Location. Welcome to the first day of your exciting new career. Whether you were approached at a job fair, read our ad in screws, bolts, and hairpins, or if this is the result of a dare, we welcome you. I will be your personal guide to help you get started. I'm a Model 5 of the Handyman's Robotics and Unit Repair System, but you can call me Hand Unit. Your new career promises challenge, intrigue, and endless janitorial opportunities. Oh, Please like enter your name as seen above the keypad. This cannot be changed later, so please be careful. Wait, what? Do I gotta click this? Whoa, this is already... trippy. It seems that you had some trouble with the keypad. I see what you were trying to type, and I will auto-correct it for you. One moment. Welcome, Eggs Benedict. Eggs Benedict, alright! I like that. I wonder if that's completely random. That'd be good to know. So I gotta remember that. Eggs Benedict. Night one. Okay. I'm like in an elevator. You can now open the elevator using that bright, red, and obvious button. Let's get to work. What? What the Allow hell? Allow me to fill this somewhat frightening silence with some light-hearted banter. Due to the massive success, and even more so the unfortunate closing of Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, it was clear that the stage was set, no pun intended, for another contender in children's entertainment. Unlike most entertainment venues, our robotic entertainers are rented out for private parties during the day, and it's your job to get the robots back in proper working order before the following morning. You are now in the primary control module. It's actually a crawl space between the two front showrooms. Now, let's get started with your daily tasks. View the window to your left. This is the Ballora Gallery party room and dance studio, encouraging kids to get fit and enjoy pizza. Let's turn on the light and see if Ballora is on stage. Press the blue button on the elevated keypad to your left. Uh-oh, it looks like Ballora doesn't feel like dancing. Let's give her some motivation. Press the red button now to administer a controlled shock. Maybe that will put the spring back in her step. Let's check the light again. Excellent. Bellora is feeling like her old self again and will be ready to perform again tomorrow. Now view the window to your right. This is the Funtime Auditorium, where Funtime Foxy encourages kids to play and share. Try the light. Let's see what Funtime Foxy is up to. Looks like Funtime Foxy is taking the day off. Let's what? motivate Funtime Foxy with a controlled shock. Let's try another controlled shock. Looks like Funtime Foxy is in perfect working order. Great job! In front of you is another vent shaft. Crawl through it to reach the Circus Gallery control module. What? Look, 
motion trigger, circus gallery vent. On the other side of the glass is Circus Baby's auditorium. Let's check the light and see what Baby is up to. Looks like a few of the lights are out, but we can fix that later. Let's encourage Baby to cheer up with a controlled shock. Let's try another controlled shock. Let's try another controlled shock. Great job, Circus Baby. We knew we could count on you. That concludes your duties for your first night on the job. We don't want you to leave overwhelmed. Otherwise, you might not come back. Please leave using the vent behind you, and we'll see you again tomorrow. I have to go back. Motion trigger, circus gallery vent. Oh, shift complete, all right. Enjoy some time at home. Another day, another dramatic entry in the lives of Vlad and his distressed mistress. Where will they go? What will they do? All of that and more happening now. Clara, I tell you, the baby isn't mine. Count, I tell you that it is. You're the only vampire I've ever loved. And the baby turns his bottles into powdered milk. That doesn't mean anything. He sleeps on the ceiling fan. Upright or upside down. What does it matter? You need to be part of your son's life. I'm an old man, Clara. I can't be a father. Well, then at least pay your child support, you deadbeat! Will Vlad and his distressed mistress find common ground? Tune in next time. Alright, that was kind of cool. This is interesting. Let the other children go see her. Why won't you let me go? Welcome back for another night of intellectual stimulation, pivotal career choices, and self-reflection on past mistakes. We're committed to creating a unique and fulfilling work experience. One part of that commitment is ensuring that you don't get tired of the voice that you're hearing right now. Using the keypad below, please select a new companion voice. For male, press 1. For female, press 2. For text only, press 3. For other options, press 4. It seems that you had some trouble with the keypad. I see what you were trying to type and I will auto-correct it for you. Thank you for choosing Angsty Teen. Angsty Teen. Great. Alright, this elevator is, uh... Really creepy. There's nothing else I can push in here. Ah, oh, night two. All right. So the elevator stopped. You know the routine. Yeah. Get up now or. Whatever. Stay here if you want. So, funny story. A dead body was found in this vent once. Okay, so, not that funny, but it's a story. Okay. Okay, let's start with your nightly chores. You should check on Ballora and make sure she's on her stage, but... Whatever. Huh. I guess Ballora has better things to do. 
Let's zap her. That should be fun. Let's check on Funtime Foxy. Make sure he's ready for showtime tomorrow. Great. 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 What? There seems to have been a problem with the voice synthesizer. Default oh. settings have been restored. Please proceed through the vent ahead of you to Circus Baby's auditorium. Well, I, I didn't get them back on the stage. They're just silhouettes. Oh no, what's gonna happen? Motion trigger. Circus gallery vent. Circus Baby had a busy day today. Let's check the light and make sure she's in proper working order. Oh, Circus Baby, we aren't here to play hide-and-seek. Let's encourage Baby to come out of hiding with a controlled shock. Let's try another controlled shock. Uh-oh. There seems to be a power malfunction that is affecting our ability to properly motivate Baby. Uh-oh. Please stand by while I reboot the system. I will be offline momentarily during this process. Various other systems may be offline as well, such as security doors, vent locks, and oxygen. Commencing system restart. And oxygen? Motion trigger, entryway vent. Funtime auditorium maintenance vent opened. Bullard gallery maintenance vent opened. I don't recognize you. You are new. I remember this scenario, however. It's a strange thing to want to do, to come here. I'm curious what events would lead a person to want to spend their nights in a place like this. Willingly. Maybe curiosity? Maybe ignorance? There is a space under the desk Someone before you crafted it into a hiding place, and it worked for him. I recommend that you hurry, though. You will be safe there. Just try not to make eye contact. It will be over soon. They will lose interest. What? Here, click and drag. What the f is going on? the hell? Um, I didn't open that. Oh 
Oh my god! What was that? What was I supposed to do? What was I supposed to do? Okay. Wait. Still under the desk? Alright, I'm just gonna stay over here. I shouldn't be able to see. Saw the eye right there, though. Jesus! What am I supposed to do? Okay, alright. Let's try this one more time. Okay, turn the flashlight off. supposed to do? Is that the eye right there? That's the eye. Dead again. Okay. Alright. I have no idea what to do. I'm not going to continue. I'm going to end it here. I'll get back in. We'll continue it from there. I just wanted to get a nice sneak peek in here. Nice little video for you guys. So thank you very much for tuning in. Wow. All right. Well, this concludes this episode of Five Nights at Freddy's Sister Location. Still trying to get a grasp on what's going on, but I'm pretty sure we'll figure it out. And if you have liked this, please hit like, subscribe, throw a comment in the comment section below. But for now, this is your boy Balls on you. Telling everybody to please be excellent to each other while I change the world one creepy robotic at a time so you all have a fantastic day and I am going to see you all next time suit and if you haven't noticed it's definitely a different locale than my normal videos, my normal vlogs. Well, I decided to pick a different section of my house to actually record this to make it look good. So, just an artist's triumph. Gallery opening wows critics. Some call him the new Caravaggio. Others compare him to